Hello, collective. Welcome back to my platform. Thank you for watching as always. Please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. You are appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. Please remember to stay in the purest of white lights, okay? I return to source. I return to sender all negative energy and intent immediately and permanently, okay? Anything the enemy has stolen from you is being returned to you as we speak. All evil and negative plans and intentions of the enemies against you and your loved ones are being dismantled. As I have said, so shall it be. Judgment is final. Let's go ahead and find out what in the name of source is going on here. I hope you all are staying well, happy, and joyful in life. Okay. We have a king, queen of pentacles. I don't know why I said king. Maybe there's a king of pentacles involved in this situation. Let's go ahead and find out. We have a king, a, again, king. So this could be a man. Maybe he's just showing up in his feminine energy. We have the queen of pentacles out here, followed by that Lord Jesus, <laughs> the five of swords. What in the world is going on here? So there could be a queen of pentacles, possibly a mother figure, wife, someone of that nature. that may have taken some type of action that she's going to regret. Someone is absolutely determined to defeat another person. They don't care how they go about defeating this person. This is because, oh, someone has fallen from grace. This is because someone wants what belongs to another person, but they cannot have it. It does not belong to them. And I think this has been revealed to them. Someone is very uh, malicious and devious. Someone feels entitled to what belongs to other people. So, collective, don't take it personal. This is someone that will do this to any and everyone, even her own friends and family. The people that she's working with, possibly against you, which she will do the same thing too. People may be separating themselves from this person because they see her not for who she really is. This person has lost their connection to source. Someone is not protected. Whatever action they took is not going to be going in their favor. Someone is refusing to heal. Someone is refusing to work with another character. You could be the one she does not want to work with. You could be a star C and this person operates from their lower energy. So they don't want to have to work with you, right? Someone is not a team player. She does not want you either in an organization or in a union with someone. You could have some type of contract with another person and this woman does not want you and this person coming together. This is the truth, honey. You know it. She knows it. They know it. The universe knows what's going on. Someone knows the truth. I'm telling you, this may have to do with a union. Someone may know the truth about what this person has been doing. Um, and it's going to be exposed, right? Someone knows that you are a divine feminine. You are someone who's a high priestess. You know the truth about what they've been doing. People know the truth as well, okay? Someone wants you to fall from grace. They may be saying that you're not someone in the upright, but that's not true. Someone could be working with a, a, a character. Maybe they got your divine masculine to fall from grace by betraying you and exposing something they should not have. Someone be, may be out here telling your personal business, even though they should not be doing that. Someone you may have had a contract with. There's something like that going on. Someone is trying to pretend like there are something that they were not. This queen of pentacles could have been pretending to be someone angelic. A star see something of that nature, but this is someone that has fallen from grace and is going to be seen or is being seen for exactly who she is. People may be separating from her. Maybe whatever plan she had, this devious plan to take someone else down or to take what belongs to another person. Yeah, it's a tower. People are walking away from this woman. It's a tower. She's falling from grace. Okay. Someone is falling from grace, losing everything absolutely everything okay and she knows she knows that you know right she knows what's going on there could be something about a contract a d a will that this woman is hiding is that she's trying to force or forged something either a signature or to force something to go in her way i'm telling you she's trying to force it She's trying to force something to go in her way. It could be a will. It could be a contract. 
some type of deed to a property. This woman is trying to force it to belong to her, but it will not be belonging to her. It's not hers. Okay? Someone interfered with some type of divine union as well is what I'm hearing. It's like she knew you and someone were meant to be or she found out and she interfered with that. It could also be that this woman found out that maybe you were supposed to be replacing her or this could be a masculine that found out you were supposed to be replacing them at a company or something like that and they took action to block you. They don't want you moving forward. They're trying to make things as difficult for you as possible. Someone wants you working over time, right? putting in a lot of work with no reward someone is extremely malicious extremely malicious they've been like this for a long time this is someone that's just greedy does not care who she's cutting to get what she wants even the people that she's working with and mind you this could be a man in his feminine energy as well but this is someone that does not care who she sneaks to get what she wants. She's going to get what she wants, is what I'm hearing, okay? This woman has something that's burdening her. She has a lot of anxiety going on. She may have taken some type of action, trying to, yeah, she has anxiety going on. There's an ending that she's going through while you are going through some type of rebirth. Things are being balanced out. Something, Something is coming to an end. It's that her kingdom is coming to an end and your kingdom is ticking off. The sun is setting on her as it is rising on you. Okay? Someone didn't expect for things to be... Like, there's something that's being looked over. even Either a document, something she said, something she did, or some, someone that was working with her. Something they said or did. It exposed these people. Okay? But regardless of what actions this woman so you are still moving forward. You're almost at your destination. And this is what she does not want you to know. It says she thinks, oh, well, if they don't know about this, whatever belongs to them, they'll stay over there. They may be paying people behind the scenes to keep you stuck somewhere. It said, hey, here's $200,000 for your business. Keep them stuck. Keep them happy. Give them whatever they want, okay? Don't let them know that anything is going on. If they're upset, you just act like you're not upset with them or at them. Everything is okay. We need them to stay with you. And that's because they don't want you going somewhere because if you go somewhere, something is going to be given to you. And when it's given to you, this person is going to be losing everything they have access to. Someone is a thief. Someone is trying to keep you stuck in some type of confusion. They're trying to distract you. So you can miss out on an opportunity. Yeah, on an opportunity. They want you to miss out on an opportunity, but your pathway is clear. You're still going to receive this opportunity or even something better. Your pathway is clear. The truth is being illuminated. Yeah. Working over time to destroy you. Working over time. That is crazy. Oh, Lord, that's crazy. Someone is absolutely working over time to cause an ending. Either to your work, finances, love, your connections, something. This woman or whoever this is has been bribing a lot of people. There's, there's a whole network of companies and people working together to cause an ending for someone but it's not going to go in their favor people are sealing their fate desperation the word desperation has been coming out a lot someone is desperate desperate to hold on to something that does not belong to them listen desperate to hold on to something that does not belong to her or him Someone has gotten accustomed to some final way of living. They get all the money in the world for doing really nothing. Maybe traveling around the world and things like that. Or traveling across state lines and things like that. Doing barely anything. But they're living a good life. This person is could be like... Because they have this uh, a five of swords after them. This could be someone lazy. And they steal other people's work. But they make it look like it's theirs. <clears throat> This is someone that does not mind taking credit for other people's work. And she's exposed. In the past, she could have been pretending to be someone in the upright, but she's exposed. 
the truth is known about her. That she'll do anything. She'll betray anyone. She'll steal anyone's work. And make it look like theirs. And get credit for it. And she doesn't care. She does not care. She does not care. Okay? This is not a team, a team player. This is not someone you flourish with when you work with them. Some of you, this could have been someone you were friends with. This could be someone from your past, people you may not know. Laura, it's a whole lot going on. But this woman here, this is not a team player. This is not someone you want to commit to in business or in relationship. This is someone that's strictly there for themselves. For themselves. Okay? What matters to her, how she benefits in the situation, that's all that matters to her. What matters to you is irrelevant. This is not a team player. But she will pretend to be a team player until she gets what she wants out of the situation. Someone here, your divine masculine, has fallen from grace because he collaborated with this person. He accepted some type of bribery. You're going to have to find yourself a new divine masculine. It's a whole collaboration between people. Grandmas, aunties, uncles, cousins, co-workers, frenemies, long-term friends, they all know. Everyone know but you. Or everyone knew but you. But now you know through this message. Okay? A lot of these people have been sending you energy, blocking you in some way, and it's not going to be working anymore. These people have trapped themselves and bonded themselves to something because they accepted money. They accepted a payout. Okay? You have full sight of this situation. You know what's going on. The truth is going to be exposed. You're about to be making new connections and things like that. This woman could be waiting to hear some type of news about you. She wants to hear about some type of ending for you. She's not going to be receiving it. Is that someone is making calling calling shots far, far away from you? This is someone that's possibly not even in your neighborhood, but she knows where you are, right? She knows where you are. You're supposed to be replacing this person, so they know where you are. So they're calling shots. They've paid people around you to keep their mouth shut, to mess with you, interfere with your forward movement, keep you stuck at some uh, uh, company you work for or in some type of relationship. If it has to do with you connecting to someone that's in connection with her, it doesn't have to be her husband, her ex, or anything. It could be her son, nephew, cousin, whoever. She doesn't want you connecting with them. So she's making shots, calling shots around you, interfering with your life, your livelihood, things of that nature, right? And she's waiting to hear some type of message about you. And it's going to be a tower because you're still going to be prosperous. Just like, is she sad yet? Is she having anxiety? Is she living in fear? Did she roll over? They're like, uh, no, no, and no. The collective is moving forward. What do we do? What would you like us to do? We've done everything you asked us to do. We've done a correction. We've done everything you paid us to do. We've played dumb. We've played naive to what they are saying. She's not budging. He's not budging. What would you like us to do? Because these people, they're buying it to whatever this is because they accept their money. They accept their money. Yeah, they accept their money. <laughs> you see this pentacle, this king of pentacles? They accept their money. There could be a king of pentacles in here that accepted some type of money, thinking that it was going to be a brand new beginning for him. He thought he was doing the right thing, stepping out on faith. Someone has a rule awakening coming for him because he's about to go through some type of ending himself. <laughs> These people are fighting amongst themselves. Oh, I said ending, and there goes the death card. There's a king of pentacles that's about to go through some type of ending that he's not expecting. He made the wrong call. Wrong call, wrong judgment. This woman is going to be waiting for a while. He said, we, we did this today. What happened? 
Did you do what I told you to do to her or him? What did they say? What did they do? You mean they weren't crying? No? They didn't give up? They didn't call to beg you for something? They didn't tell you that they're really sorry? They want to work things out? They want to come back to you? They didn't do any of that? Come on. Someone is like so childish and immature. Oh, 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 look at that. They may want to settle with you now. Come on. It's the back and forth with me. Like, what do you want? So this person, basically, all they do is bribe people behind the scenes. They don't mind bribing you either, Collective. Is that, hey, we know you're worth $14 million. We're not going to tell you you're worth $14 million, but we're breadcrumb you. Why don't you say you, you accept $50,000 and we can settle? This is like someone bringing you a court case, knowing goddamn well they should not be bringing you that court case because there's a whole lot of mess going on behind the scenes that they think no one is aware of. And they want to come in and make it seem like they're doing you a favor or something in this court case. Like, we'll settle with you. You know, we know you owe us a lot of money, but we'll settle with you. We say, no, we don't need to settle. I want what's mine. Nice try, though. Someone, someone is walking around bold as heck, acting like they're all happy, they're in charge, they're in control of the situation, and this is them behind closed doors. This is what they want for you, but this is them behind closed doors. Still trying to bribe people, still networking and trying to bribe people. They, they, they're starting to run short on the amount of people they can bribe. Someone does not want something being exposed about them, but it I don't even think they realize it's already exposed. Like they're trying to block you, but they don't realize the people that they've been working with already exposed them. You see the the, the hanging man here? Someone already exposed you. The truth is already known. So you're coming after the wrong person. They're coming after you collective, but they don't realize their friends, their partners in crimes already exposed them. They said, look, listen, 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 Linda, Linda, listen, listen. When we go to grandma's house, we don't have all these problems, okay? Okay, we've been coming to your house. I know we live with you, Linda, or we work with you, Linda, but at grandma's house, yeah, at Grandma's house, we don't have any of this problem. We do everything we want to do without any catch. Okay, Linda, thank you for the money. Okay, thank you for the experience, but we are out. We don't want to be part of this anymore. Okay, Linda, 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 you're not listening. Linda, 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 will you listen, Linda? We are not part of this anymore, okay? People martyr themselves in this situation. They were guided to see things from a higher perspective, but that money was just too good to turn down. Some of these people are about to be experiencing endings they could not have thought of or even imagined. All in the name of money. He said, oh, you mean all I have to do is lie on them and I get $40,000? Where is the, where are the dotted lines so I can sign my name? Sign me up, folks. I am up for it. Oh, you mean all I have to do is shut my mouth and act like I don't know what you all are doing behind the scenes? Where are the dotted lines? Sign me up, folks. And then the court case come up and say, hey, come here. Come, 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 come. Yeah, your name came up. He said, what? No, I didn't, like, what are you talking about? Oh, yeah, they said they gave you $50,000. Come on, come on. We need to talk. And now they're stuttering. You know, all the questions they practice answering, when you go in and they ask you this, you said this. They go in there, no one's asking them any of those questions. And they don't know what to say. Say, wait, 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 wait. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. They didn't tell. They didn't. We didn't practice this question. We didn't practice the answer for these questions. So hold on. Hold on. I'm not ready. I'm 
said, I don't like surprises. This was not part of the list of questions that you were supposed to be asking us. We have a script to stick to. Okay, you asked me A and I said A, A. You asked me B and I said B, B. Where are you coming from with one A? What do I say to that? Yeah, true. They're all falling from grace. The past, the present, the future, all falling from grace. Someone is not being seen as genuine anymore. People know exactly how this person is where they are in life. People know this person bribes around. People bribe, This person bribes people behind the scenes. They pretend to be genuine. Someone wants you, have, wants you to have fun memories of them or some type of organization, a place you don't. Someone wants you to see them in a light that's not fitting. Say, I want you to see me as a divine masculine, as a divine feminine. And you're looking at them like, can you even spell divine? Can you even spell divine? Will you be quiet? There are people that are not accepting bribery from this person anymore. They're done because they've been going through this cycle with this person for a long time and it's not going anywhere. People are realizing that it's not bringing them anything but chaos. So they're not accepting bribery. Someone may have gone to someone in your past trying to bribe them or this is what they're going to try to do and they won't be able to bribe them. Someone someone is not with the BS. Is that do what? You're paying me to do what? Like get away from me. What is wrong with you? You're so weird and like, what's wrong with you? Like, what about me made, made you think that I will be accepting that? Like, I want to be part of that. Someone is content in life. So they don't, they're not going to be accepting any bribery from you. They see that as a breadcrumbing offer. Someone is going to think like you're insulting their intelligence, their morals, their character, because you're offering them something. And collective, this is someone from your past. Whoever this is from your past that's not accepting bribery, kudos to them. Because this is like one out of maybe 50 people that did not accept the bribery. They're content in life. They're fulfilled. They don't need bribery. They don't need pocket change. They don't get excited at the thought or the sound of money. Someone saying, oh, I have $50,000. They don't go, oh, yippee, sign me up. So I'm going to say, no, I'm good. You don't want to be part of no collaboration. Meanwhile, your whole divine masculine has fallen from grace. They're no longer sincere. You're not going to be seeing this person in a sincere energy anymore. They may want to apologize to you, but you're not looking for an apology. They want you to have fond memories of them. You don't have any fond memories of them. You don't see this person as genuine anymore. Someone is losing their cool. It's like... What do you what did you expect? What did you expect to happen exactly? Like you were supposed to fall from grace for betraying our union, our friendship, whatever this is, and I was just supposed to be like, oh yes, okay, dear. I forgive you. Someone from your past now sees you as someone loyal. They're like, oh, you mean you weren't my enemy all these years? You weren't betraying me? Like you knew the truth all along about me and what I did. So you mean I cannot come back to you? Uh, no, 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 no. You stay where you are. I'm moving forward. Collective, this is you. I know what everybody did. I know you all are watching me. You know that I know that you know that I know that you know that I know that you know. Just so you know. We all know. Someone now sees that you are loyal. You're someone worth committing to. You're someone with spiritual gifts that they should have respected. They should have taken serious instead of dismissing you. And this is them now. Disappointed in themselves. That why did I take this action against this person? Why did I betray this person? I had them right in the palm of my hand. You know, like this tree right here. They had you just like this. And they said, mm. and people are going to think that tree is funny. People are going to think that tree is odd. It's not exactly full. And it, 
And then when he finally find out, oh, that's an amethyst? Ooh, that's royal? Oh my gosh. And then this is them. Disappointed. Disappointment upon disappointment. The offer that they're receiving, they aren't interested anymore. They could be receiving offers from some scallywags, things like that. Women are no longer interested in those low vibrational women they thought were better than you. Now they don't want to. Oh, someone found themselves. They're going within now to find the truth. That, oh, why did they not listen to my higher self? Why didn't I listen to my higher self? But your past will not be returning to you. Okay? To break from you with anything. With money, love. I mean, you're moving forward in abundance. New beginnings. You're about to be flourishing. A flourishing life. Okay? You're about to be acquiring new skills. This is what you're being uh, guided to do is to perfect your skill. Pay attention to your spiritual gift. All right? Take time to even to improve them. Get well acquainted with them. This is something I'm working on right now. It's perfecting my skills as well. Because I'm a little rough around the edges in a lot of different ways. In my career, in my life, as a mother, as an a, a, a employee, as a child of the Most High, I'm rough around the edges. I'm a diamond in the rough. And I don't even pretend to not be because, honey, who has time? You're either going to accept me for me or you're going to reject me. Either way, I'm going to be a diamond in the rough. I don't plan on changing it for anyone. Because that's that uh, 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 je ne sais quoi about me. That being rough around the edges, that's part of my je ne sais quoi. So I don't have any motivations to change that. I know myself very well. You can tell me something about me and I'll know if you're BSing around or if you're not. I'll know if you're hating or you're telling the truth. Like, what, anything you said to me about me, I don't know if it's true or not. And it's, I used to be someone that was very easy to trick her, but now it's like, oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Because I've taken the time to heal from all of those things. So, if you're saying something to trigger me, you're entertaining me. It's like, oh, okay. Honey, I've accepted all of it. They're all part of my abundance now. They say, yes, I went through that. Thank you. I learned from it. But you didn't learn from yours. Would you like us to bring yours up? No? You don't want to talk about that? You don't want to bring that up? Oh, oh, oh. Bad timing? Oh, okay. Yep. Whole lot of people in here. Whole lot of people. There could be a king of wands that's realizing he betrayed you. Someone partner up with a group of people to go up against you. And now he's realizing this could be the person from your past. It's this king of wands. Possibly you dated them. Possibly you worked with them. Possibly you went to school something. You knew this person. But they betrayed you. Okay? They all betrayed you. The person from your past. Your divine masculine. Whoever this person is. A whole lot of other people with this uh, um, madness here. They all collaborated to destroy you. Someone accepted a bait at the last minute. It's like someone knew, knew better. Someone knew better, but they caved in. They had to, there was someone where they had to be approached a few times. It's like they went to them the first time and said, Hey, we'll give you this amount of money if you do this. And you said, Nah, I'm good. I got my own money. They came back again. Hey, the price just went up. Nah, I have my own money. I'm good. That that sounds stupid as heck. Well, the last price they came up with, it was just too good for it to be turned down. So your brother, whoever he is, he accepted the offer and he fell immediately from grace. You don't see him in a genuine nature anymore. This is not someone you want to have a connection with and it's breaking them. Okay. Someone came up in life just by uh, 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 maybe blackmailing people, bribing people. And honestly, he can blackmail any of these people. Someone may be getting blackmailed. 
Someone may be getting blackmail in their situation. They say, hey, if you don't do this, I'm going to expose you. I'm going to tell them you accepted this amount of money. I'm going to take you to court, wherever. And this person may have people in the court system that they can use at their disposal. Or maybe someone has some type of interesting video or recording of another person and they're blackmailing them with that. It's that you're uh, blackmailing. It's that you're going to do what I told you to do. Or we're going to expose you. You're not leaving this situation. You can't act like you weren't a part of it. So you can pretend all you want. Someone can't pretend anymore. Someone was pretending for a long time, but they can't pretend anymore. Someone was a divine masculine. There are... <laughs> I keep getting something about uh, two masculines. One acts like they are a friend to someone and the other one does malicious things from behind the scenes. Okay, the other one does malicious things from behind the scenes. One is pretending to be your friend and the other one is doing things from behind the scenes. They don't want from behind the scenes. Okay? They want to act like they have nothing to do with the situation. You know, this is possibly the person that fell from grace. I don't know. But someone you best believe in your energy is pretending to have nothing to do with the situation. And they do. Greed led them. They're fighting. They're fighting. The karmics are fighting. The, the karmics are fighting. Someone has a social platform and you best believe the people that are following you are part of this collaboration. There's a community of people following you. Gaslighting you in the comment section. Acting like they, they support you. It's all these lower vibrational energies. Some of these people have been hired to stalk you online. Put stupid comments in your comment section. Things of that nature. This is how extensive these people were willing to go. People were bribed to follow you. People have their kids watching you. People have family members watching you and reporting back to them. Because the people that they're reporting to don't want you doing any type of... If you're like a reader, which is what I'm getting... They don't want you reading their energy, so they have third parties or second parties watching you and reporting to them. It is crazy. Burden. This whole group is burdened. They're burdened. They were expecting to be successful. With this woman, she was expecting to be successful. There will be no success. They're burdened. Everything they've been doing is being exposed. Every action that was taken is being exposed. It's all being exposed. Someone is being seen for exactly who they are. They said, we know you're a thief. We know you're not divine. <laughs> we know you steal. You steal from other people. You stole that person's work. You stole that person's money. You stole that person's house. You stole that person's property. You're a thief. That's all you are is a common thief. And you're out here pretending to be divine. Someone from your past accepted bribery. You could have had some type of connection with this person. They accepted bribery. All of these people were bribed. And they all binded themselves because now it's too late. I don't know. This was like this. I'm going to put it in the upright. Either way, the truth will be exposed. Lord have mercy. Expose. Yeah. Burden. Can't go to sleep. Having anxiety. Lots of worries. What kind of friendship and collaboration is that? <laughs> Is that what you uh, meant when you said elevation? You get paid a bribe to do something to someone and you can't get a good night's sleep? 
you're waiting to hear disappointing news about someone but you're never gonna get it i'm telling you all of these people are living in fear and anxiety someone's trying to protect himself from these people your whatever belongs to you collective is being protected it's not going to be given to anyone yeah, they were trying to steal your money, your love, your forward movement. They're trying to block everything. It's all exposed. It's like, nah, I don't think so. That's the most high. The most high is like, I don't think so. Your ancestors are intervening, taking actions on your behind, on your, on your behalf. I didn't say on your behind. I, mean, I didn't mean to say on your behind. <laughs> you are sailing on the karma water waters everything is being illuminated all the trickery the backstabbing the lies the deceit everything is being illuminated about this group and they're fighting amongst themselves someone took actions to bring to do something and this group was not in correlation with it they didn't want this person doing it but the person did it anyways and now there's a fight going on because someone has just ensured an ending for everyone in that group. It's a tower for everyone involved. It's an ending. People are about to be leaving an institution, a COVID, some type of community. People are about to be leaving. And they don't care what they have, what they don't have, why they're leaving. They're going to be leaving because the truth is about to be exposed about an institution and a, a, a energy, either a feminine energy or a masculine energy. People are going to find out what they've been doing behind the scenes. They say, oh, this is what you've been using our money for? Oh, this is not what we hire you to do. You're going to have to pay us back every dime. Everything you spent and everything we're going to lose, you're going to have to pay us back. Someone does not realize they're collecting debt. You're going to have to pay us back everything you spent. Because we know you're not a millionaire. You don't spend about $500,000 bribing people. About a million dollars bribing people. Where did you get those millions? Our company? Oh, most definitely. You got to pay us back every dime. Every penny counts. Someone, is, someone just bonded themselves in a way they cannot imagine. Someone just ensure an ending for themselves. He said, we didn't hire you to do this. We didn't hire you to go bribing people just because you knew you were being replaced. That's not mean you can go stealing from people. You were trying to steal an opportunity from someone, so what? You started bribing people with our money? Oh, you got to pay us back. It's our money and we need it now. <laughs> Tower. You're about to be entering into some type of institution people didn't want you entering into. Either because there's some type of position there for some of you or the institution belongs to you. <laughs> Something. Also, honey, listen. Someone's life is about to be so different. Whereas collective, your life is going up. Someone's life is just crashing down and they won't be able to recover. It said whatever someone is praying for or manifesting for you, they are manifesting it for themselves. Someone is done. They just ensure their own ending. And this is all out of greed, hatred, maliciousness. I'm telling you. Someone is not going to be successful like they thought they were going to be. I'm going to read this card. I try not to read my cards. Uncertainty of success blocked out of control, lack of willpower, want to give up, wrong direction. I'm telling you, someone is in the wrong direction. They're not sure if they can defeat you, but they still want to bring you problems. 
How do you make a move not knowing if you're going to be able to be successful in that? That's called wrong calculation, false calculation, miscalculation. And that's called ego. You're so set on defeating someone else that you take reckless action. Reckless. Because you want to see someone else down. So you're willing to destroy yourself just to see someone else down. And this is someone that is in high honor. But they're being seen for exactly who they are. Insincere. Not holier than thou. Not a divine being. Not a just person. Not a team worker. Not a team player. Exposed. Someone took some type of action and they're not sure they should have taken that action. You should not have. Sometimes you need to just let bygones be bygones. I'm telling you, they are not sure. Someone is not sure they took the right action. Or they should take the action that they're planning on taking. It's reckless. That's a reckless way of living. That's a reckless way of living. so reckless why do something you're unsure of and then you know other people behind are on are on the line because you weren't working alone you included other people other organizations and things like that but you're so greedy that you don't care you think you're going to get a promotion out of this some type of elevation in life and something is going to be given to you nothing is going to be given to you Justice is going to be brought into this situation. Nothing is going to be given to you. You may end up having to pay someone else some money. This queen of pentacles, this greedy woman has been showing up in my readings a lot. A lot. And I think I made a video saying that this queen of pentacles is about to take, make her last wrong move. And it's going to lead to her ending. And here we are. She sure did. She surely, surely did. She did. You're out here paying people to temper with people with people's health. Trying to manifest illness in people's lives. Endings in people's lives. Deaths in people's lives. What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? You want to tell me all the time you talk to think and think and think this is the best you could come up with? Someone is going to be healing. You should take time to heal. You need to take time to heal. You're Listen to that. Listen, listen. Linda, Linda, when we go to grandma's house, we don't have to deal with all this stuff. Okay, Linda? You're manifesting endings for yourself, thinking you're manifesting it for someone else. Whoever you're coming up against is going to move on. They're going to heal. They are going to heal and recover. They're still going to manifest the reality that they want. And they're still going to go to grandma's house and do whatever they want. Someone literally, someone literally manifested an illness in their life because they were so set on destroying someone else. I didn't even know that was down there. Someone manifested an illness in their life because they were so set on destroying someone else. Now they're going through financial hardship, confused as heck, dealing with mental conflict, emotional conflict. Losing friends and families, friendships, relationships, living in fear and anxiety because they didn't know how to leave someone alone. 
Someone was so set on destroying another person that they destroyed their own life. In one move. Should have walked away, Linda. You should have probably went to grandma's house and saw how grandma does things. We told you when we go to grandma's house, we do we 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 do everything. She doesn't give us problems, Linda. Yeah, Linda didn't walk away. Linda's going through her ending. But it's okay. It's a rebirth, Linda. New life. This is going to help you heal. You need healing. You're refusing to heal. You've been refusing to heal for years, decades, Linda. You're going to get the chance to heal. Healing is necessary. Healing is something that is essential for everybody. This will help you move forward so you can actually live a fulfilling life and be content in life like everybody else and not feeling the need to betray and deceive and harm other people and other people. Okay, Linda? Linda should have walked away. Linda should have seen things from a higher perspective, but Linda decided not to. Now there's problems. The truth is being seen about Linda. Linda said, no, I'm telling you. She is not in the upright. She's not the real star C. I'm the real star C. He's not the real star C. It's me. This belongs to me. Linda, you're impulsive. You belong to me. Linda, you're causing illusions. That's my house, Linda. That's not your house. You're causing illusions. Linda said, oh, I'm done with this. I can't. I've gotten nothing from this but loss. I've lost my money. I've paid almost $2 million to people trying to block this person and they're still moving forward. Now I'm sick. I've martyred myself. And this person is still standing their ground. I thought they were going to roll over and let me do whatever I want to do. Why are they not letting me do what I want to do? I always get what I want. Yeah, Linda, you're... She's getting what she wants. He's getting what he wants. He's defeating you. And you and your partners in crimes are going to be disappointed. This, this awakening, this humbling experience was necessary for all of you. It's that. Yeah, honey, I'm telling you, this is the truth. You and your pals, you're all defeated. The truth that you've been refusing to see is going to be seen. Whatever message you've been trying to block is going to be received, has been received. Okay, Linda? He said, hey, if you do this, I'll give you this position. Once I receive this that belongs to this collective person, this star C. Hey, if you do this, you can be the vice president. Hey, if you do this, you can be the assistant vice president. Hey, if you do this, you can own 2% of the company. That Darcy doesn't belong here. That Darcy doesn't think like us. They have morals. Who cares about morals? They talk about healing. No one cares about healing. But Linda, you're going to have to move on. You and your pals, it's time to move on. Go on now. Get. Yep. Whatever situation is going on, the truth is going to be exposed. 
about things that's been going on behind the scenes is absolutely going to be exposed. Someone has trapped themselves in a group of people in a situation they should not be in because of greed. Okay? The truth is going to be exposed about something that has to do with someone's finances, how people have been stealing from another person, trying to block the forward movement. And whoever this is, collective, you're moving forward. Someone here received some type of advice not to partake in something, and they still did. Someone was told to take a different path. They still took the wrong path. They thought they were going to be abundant. I'm telling you, someone was advised to see things from a higher perspective. They did not. And whoever they're coming after is protected. Things are going to be balanced out. Someone tried to paint another energy in a light that's not true. It said you being like a star sea and someone saying that you're the devil. Basically. You are the devil. Or a star sea in the reverse. You know in readings, the star hardly ever appears in the reverse. And if it does appear in the reverse, that's alarming. It's alarming. It's alarming as heck. That means that there's something that's hidden and you need eyes, spiritual eyes that are open, wide open for you to see what's hidden. And someone like me, what I've noticed in my life is that a lot of the times when I'm up against people, my enemies, they're focusing on the physical. Meanwhile, I'm seeing things that are in the spirit and what's going on behind the scenes. So it doesn't matter how hard you try to hide something, I will still know. I will still know. So I know what's going on beneath the roof. Beneath, <laughs> excuse me. I know what's going on beneath the roots. Underground. Things are going on in hidden places. Because I can be sitting from you and I'll have a vision and I'll see what you've been partaking in. I won't tell you. I can go to sleep and I can have a dream about a conversation, a meeting you all have. And I won't tell you, like I'll know verbatim every word someone said in that meeting. But when I wake up, that's between me and the most high. So that's what I'm saying. Some of these people are fighting battles because they think they have secured themselves. They're not secure. The truth is going to be revealed. People have financial problems coming in. People have legal issues coming in. It was an illusion that they were going to be bountiful. There's a couple here going through an ending. People are about to be separating themselves from a group, a community, a collaboration, a couple, a friend. This whole thing is over. It's over. Someone may have tried to use you to manifest something in your life that's not your energy. Yeah, listen. Like, they wanted you to manifest some type of dark energy in your life. Where you're toxic, indulging in low vibrational activities. If you're not someone with additions, you end up with additions. Doing things that you know you would never do in, in a million years if you were in your higher energy someone was trying to get you to manifest something in your life something some type of illness some type of ending and it's not working there's a there's some type of cult like mentality going on here and it's because of this person all uh, because of greed i'm telling you <laughs> victory for you collective you are about to defeat your enemies in a way that they are not expecting. This battle is not even going anywhere. It's going to be over before it even starts. He said, why did I do this? There's someone from one of you's past. And this man, whoever this is, is so disappointed in himself. Why did I partake in this? Why did I betray this person? They were genuine with me. Why did I uh, collaborate with this group? But on the surface, you know what they're going to say? I don't give a crap about that person. 
about that collective. I don't give a crap about that. They're hiding, they're hiding it. They're hiding their emotions. They don't want the truth to be seen. And they deep down on the inside, you know when you look in the mirror, you know the truth is looking at you. You know what's going on. You're sick to your stomach because you betrayed someone that didn't. I'm telling you, collective, you have wish fulfillment coming towards you. You keep pushing forward, okay? Whatever your enemies are doing is already exposed. If it's not, it's going to be for some of you, but most of you is exposed. We're in the age of our careers. Things are being exposed. Everything, everything will be exposed. The karmics will keep fighting. The karmics are fighting, as they always do. But they, while they're fighting, they want us to live in fear and anxiety. It's the hypocrisy for me. It's the pretentiousness for me. It's the denial for me. Denial is a river in Egypt, but they forget. Lord. Mm -mm. Source, what is your advice? Okay, thank you, Source. I want to do another one. Source, what is your advice to us today? What do, okay. What would you like us to be aware of? Okay. I'm gonna hurry because my camera, I think it's on like 10% or 7%, something like that. Okay, so we have zero. Um, it says you are one with the creator, and there are no limits to what you can achieve. You have the ability to create something new and incredible in your lifetime here on earth. I am a creator. Maybe your nemesis, your enemies, cut, they were going to control your path, but they cannot. You still have victory. Okay, we have 20. The number two, which usually has to do with successful unions, collaborations, business partnerships, and things like that. It said you relate to others on an almost cosmic level. You are dedicated to building harmonious relationships of all kinds. You have the ability to persuade others to your point of view by using gentle means. I am harmonious. Okay, thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.